Good evening, baby. Today's bedtime story is called Jimmy and the Magic Stone. The story takes place in a vibrant European town where the sun shines in every corner and childish smiles bloom on every child's face. In this colorful town, there is a special boy whose name is Jimmy. His dashing blue eyes are full of hopes and dreams. On a sunny afternoon, Jimmy was sweating in the sweltering air when he overheard a stone on the ground by the forest glittering brightly in the sun. Jimmy picked the stone up for a closer look and brought it back home. The stone was so special that Jimmy realized that it seemed to have magical powers and that by making a sincere wish to it, a wish could be granted. The magic stone seems to have a heart-to-heart -heart with Jimmy. With it, Jimmy saved the trapped kitten, but also solved a lot of problems in the town. He gradually became a small-town hero. However, life is always full of unknowns. One day, the town suddenly appeared in a famine. In the face of this situation, Jimmy could not help but feel deeply powerless. Jimmy knew very well that if he used the magic stone to fulfill his wish and help the town to solve the famine, the magic stone would run out of its last spiritual power and turn into an ordinary stone. Should he keep the magic stone to help realize his dream, or should he use it to solve the town's current big problem? Jimmy was deeply in deep thought. Jimmy was very torn inside. But Jimmy understood that everyone in the town needed him and he couldn't just sit back and do nothing. Jimmy decided to use his mind to communicate with the magic stone, and he was going to use his wish to exchange for the town's life. With Jimmy's heart's desire to send out, the magic stone burst out a strong light. The town immediately restored vitality, people once again with a smile on the streets and lanes to play. Jimmy's kindness and selflessness won the respect and love of all. Remember, true strength comes from our kindness and care for others. Let's go to sleep with this warmth and look forward to tomorrow. Today's story is finished. Baby still want to hear what kind of story? You can leave a message in the comments section. I will tell you next time. Next, it's time for your baby to go to bed. I hope you have a beautiful dream. See you tomorrow.